Hi, today I am going to be making gamasso. Uh, gamasso is a sesame seed condiment um, that I think is based in Japanese cooking. I'm not totally sure about that. But uh, we're going to be using brown sesame seeds, white sesame seeds, and black sesame seeds, and some seaweed snacks, and French gray salt. You can use any kind of salt you like, but I'm using the French gray salt today. Anyway, uh, we'll get started. What I'm going to be doing is putting a tablespoon of the gray sea salt, which is a French salt, into the frying pan and toasting it for a little bit. And then I'm going to add the seaweed to that to toast it up a little bit more. This is roasted seaweed snack and you don't need to use an entire package at all or any seaweed if you don't want to but we like the seaweed in it. It gives it a nice complex flavor. And I'm just going to tear it up and put it in the frying pan with the salt. Stir it around a little bit so that you can just all get a little more toasted. And then I will be pouring this off into a separate bowl while I toast the sesame seeds. This is a really nice condiment to use on different dishes. Um, rice is really good on rice, but one of the things that we like to use it for is when we make our uh, blistered shishito peppers, it's really good to dip the, the blistered peppers in it. It makes for a really nice tapas dish. Okay, and that's toasted up. Now I'm going to add the sesame seeds. This is a really quick thing to do. So there is a cup of the brown sesame seeds and half a cup each of the white and the black. And you can hear them start to pop. When they're uh, finished toasting, you'll let them cool off and then grind them in a spice mill or else in a mortar and pestle. The spice mill is really the way to go because it's quick and easy and uh, much easier on your wrist than grinding away. And it does a good job. The sesame seeds are really pretty together. This is actually really good too on um, a bagel with cream cheese and onions sliced on it. It's just, it really adds a really nice flavor to the bagel and cream cheese. I think the person who turned me on to Gamasso a long time ago was my friend Stacy Trippany. Um, she's pretty much a in the know foodie. They smell nice. Sesame seeds are really good for you too. They're really high in uh, calcium. Good 
adjust the heat down just a little bit. <coughs> Okay, I think those are sufficiently toasted. I'm going to pour them off into the bowl and let them all cool. There we go. Now we'll let this cool off for a bit and come back to it and grind it up. Okay, so um, the sesame seeds have cooled down, so now I'm going to grind it in the spice mill. And I'll do it a quarter of a cup at a time. You want to be careful about how much you grind it because um, it can turn into sesame butter in a hurry. <laughs> is your homemade gamasso. It is delicious and adds a lot to a lot of different dishes. So be sure and try it out if you blister your shishito peppers or have it with rice. Anyway, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.